but everyone is up. Nap time is over. It's always a plus. We can blow these up. It's pretty cool. Uh, that thing I just said about blowing stuff up, total lie. Total, total lie. Total, very big lie. Quick saving every day. Quick saving every day. I want to go in there. Damn it. Oh, so I don't think we're supposed to get in here, but I'm just going to go in here because I want to see what's in here. And it's a big fat hole. Someone was making a porta potty hole. It's always a good plus. Double plus good. This is actually the tractor from uh, Squeaky the Book. Squeaky the Book based on the movie Squeaky the Door. Oh, <gasps> Sal's sack. I don't know why I'm so excited. Hey there, Sal. Got some nice glasses there. It's a nice empty bottle you got here. Hey, Sal. Well, well. A stranger to these parts, I see. You look like you can handle yourself pretty well. Those beasts outside didn't even phase you. What's up, Cuddlesworth? Scratch your chin over here. You scratch your chin. Yes, I'm new here, and yes, I can handle myself. Who are you, Professor Mustache? My name is Sal. I stay in this rundown shack just waiting for the perfect time. To jump out and rape someone? The perfect time? The perfect time for what? Please don't say to, like, kill someone. Or... The perfect time to go into the mine. You see, I'm here on a scientific expedition. I need to get into the mine. But the mine has become inhabited. Oh, really? It's now filled with irradiated ghouls. And if I go in, they'll be sure to kill me. Wait a minute. Let me get this straight, asshole. You live in a shack surrounded by death claws, but you're afraid of a bunch of ghouls? What the hell have you... <sighs> well, over years of research, I have come to discover a way to reverse the effects of radiation poisoning and radiation mutations. My god. It's quite remarkable, really. I said my, my god. My proves correct. My research could dramatically improve the lives of thousands of people. And children. And, and elephants. All I need from the mine is a sample of uranium. Done. Uranium. Don't care. But what people don't know is that uranium's radioactive energy holds a special property. I just want to get your uranium guy. You're making this too hard. In theory, this property could be harnessed and chemically altered to produce an anti-radioactive energy. Listen, I work in a box factory. I have no idea what you're talking about. Upon successful alteration, this energy could very well be used to treat anybody with radiation poisoning or radiation mutations. Okay, I'm listening. Wow, that was a mouthful of info. I'm for hire. If you got the caps, I'll get the uranium for me. Really? If you wanted to, I guess you could. I got 200 caps with your name on it if you can bring me a uranium sample. Don't worry, I'll give you a urine sample. Sounds reasonable. I'll be back with the uranium. Oh, you'll need this key to get into the mine. And take this radiation suit as well. Uranium can be very dangerous or even deadly without a rad suit. Okay. Uranium. No uranium yet? Nope. All right. Bye. Bye. Sound like. Bye. All right. So we got our uranium suit. It's not really a uranium suit, it's actually an advanced radiation suit, and I'm over encumbered now. Fan friggin' tastic. Well, don't need these kids' clothes, don't need this hat, um, don't need, don't need, son of a bitch, I'll be back. Alright, so we're good to go into the mines. Just gonna go over here and jump in here and see what's going on. Nothing. Nothing's going on in here at all. So I'm guessing he just jumped. Like, I, I, I guess he went into the... I, I don't know how he got past. Either way, we got a... God damn, I want to do that, son of a bitch. Uh, oh, I don't need any of those. Either way, uh, what the hell is wrong with me? 397, son of a bitch. You fat asshole. Just, just... 
Pinion nuts. Pinion nuts. Squirrel on a stick. Pinion nuts. Pinion nuts. Son of a bitch, man. Ah, oh, we got two. That's why. All right, all right, everyone. Let's let's just get, let's just go. Um, I don't know. This is what I'm gonna guess happened. He came in here with his sweet little stealth boy. He's like, I'm gonna go down here and get uranium. And then he went down here, and he only had enough stealth boy to get in and out. And then by the time he got down here, he's like, oh shit. So he went out and he went in the shack, and he's been pissing and shitting in the corner for the past week. I'm pretty sure that's what's happening. Hey there. I'm afraid no ghosts. Oh wait, it's that when I have to reload them. I'm quite afraid of ghosts. Good lord, guys. Step your game up. Alright, so let's find this uranium beranium. God damn it, damn it. 85%. Alrighty. Hey guys, you got a slumber party? Good lord. Someone didn't invite me to the big potato party. Not really gonna explore that much just because I want to get radiation up the yin yang. It would be cool though when I completed this if he was like, here's this radiation medicine. That was like negative 800 radiation for a thousand years. That would be pretty sweet. Nine missiles. Sure. I'll take it. Why am I singing? every song from every video game known to man. Ghostbusters isn't a video game dipshit. I'm sorry, god. Just trying to say stuff. Maybe you should shut the hell up. Well, fuck you. Dun 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 dun. Super stint pack. Hey guys, Let's see if I got a grenade, so I don't have to do this all over again. Don't run! Don't run! Don't run! Ah, oh, god damn it! No. Oh. <laughs> oh wow, my companions actually survived because they're amazing. Good job, guys. God damn it, Jimmy Minkins. We got all these live mines over here. Don't think they'll go off. Nope. We can disarm them though and pick them up. So that's pretty sweet. Jimmy, Jimmy Minkins, Jimmy Minkins, yeah. Whoa. <laughs> I love this weapon. This is my one of my favorite weapons. Uh, wow. This is very. You have found a highly radioactive piece of uranium out of the box. Bring this out to as soon as possible. Whoa, calm down there, Schmiggle McDingle Dong. Schmiggle McDingle Dong, I just got stuck. Schmiggle McDingle Dong, I just got stuck. Son of a bitch. Cool. Oh god, I'm yawning. Oh dear lordy boards. Yes, that was necessary. I know, I know you were wondering, was that necessary? Of course it was necessary. So, let's go back to Sal, tell him how cool he is, how I'm not going to punch him in the mouth for wearing glasses, and then uh, maybe he'll give us some caps, maybe he'll give us some radioactive sweetness that'll cure all our radiation that we went through, and maybe, uh, maybe not. Maybe he's a ghoul, you ever think of that? You ever get your mind blown by that one? I'm pretty sure I didn't. Cheese grater. 
All right, Sal. Let's see what you got. What's up, babe? Having trouble with that chair over there? That desk? Bet you are. You got dirty pirate kid clothes in here. Someone's gonna think you killed a kid. Wouldn't want that to happen now, would you? Why don't you take a seat? Why don't you have a seat? Why don't you have a seat? We have your conversations with the kid. Why don't you have a seat? What do you need? I don't need anything, but your voice sounds like a black man. Excellent work. You found me a sample. This has proven to be a most remarkable day. Mm. You may have just saved humanity from further radioactive mutations. Probably not. Here's your caps, like I promised. Thank you. Uranium. Uranium is the key. Mm. Bye. Bye. <clears throat> Uranium is the key. Oh, god damn it. Uranium is the key. Excuse me, sir. Uranium is the key. Uranium's the key. Oh, Jesus, I'm having a horrible hangover. I gotta go. It was nice meeting you, Sal. Uranium's the key. Uranium's the key. We'll see you later, mate. All right. Great. Googly moogly. Meow. Um, so, we got his uranium. I was hoping for a better... A better little thing. Very right, cool. Idea? Why am I yawning? What the hell is wrong with it? I was hoping for um, pretty sweet, rat away thing that would be like super duper cool, but the caps are good enough. I'll take it. Let's go. Let's give the Phantom his sweet kicking music, so we can play different songs and piss off the neighbors. Okay. So I'm gonna go and talk to uh, Stevie Wonder at the piano house, so we'll be right there. So we're back in Darksville, where everything's dark and nothing's light, and we are gonna give him some sweet sheet music, and he's gonna sheet his pants. What do you need? I don't need anything, but if you have a banana and a blanket, then we can have some fun. That's disgusting. I'm sorry. You have the sheet music. Wonderful. Wonderful. Tell that pervert next door I'll stay down here to play from now on. Here's something for your time. You've received accordion. Sheet music. Now I can play a wide variety of piano music. Thanks. He then. Bye. Bye. So, uh, be of shame if something happened to your sweet keyboard over here. Be one hell of a shame, let me tell you. So, let's go talk to Stingles McDangle Bonds. And, uh, yeah. Let's do this, Bingle Bongs. There's something outside of your window. I don't know if you noticed. Really quick. It was very minor. And we're back. We're back behind the bar. Having a sweet drink. Cuddlesworth is <laughs> new. <laughs> what are you doing, Cuddlesworth? Stop touching yourself under the goddamn counter. God damn it, Swanky Joe. Swanky Joe. Swanky Joe, can you do something about that? What do you need? Apparently Swanky Joe likes it. Piano problem. You got the piano playing to stop. How'd you do it? Oh, it don't matter. My girls can sleep, and I can enjoy the random tunes on the jukebox. God damn right, you old bitch. Here's last month's profit. I can do without it. And here's a little something that's unique. You've received antique mustache. Piano problem. Thanks again. If you're Alright. Bye. <laughs> Love when their voices change after. Um, so I don't know what the hell he gave me. I wasn't paying attention. Cuddlesworth was having a seizure. Here, here's a radiation suit. I don't need that. Snub nose AK. Oh god, what a horrible. Ugh. Ugh. At least make it yellow or something. At least they cut it out. So, cool that it's a modded weapon. Not cool that my game just crashed. 
Alright, so last time the game crashed when I, I think I tried to take out the snub nose. Pretty sure. I'm not actually sure. Nope. Uh, oh god, this is ugly. Um, good lord. Cannot see anything. So, uh, yeah. It's kind of a big problem. I'm not going to be using this because I can't see anything. Although we do get a nice advertisement for Swanky Joe's Strip Club. And bar, by the way. Um, it's good if you shoot it like this. I don't know if I have a mod on that's doing that. But I don't think so. Or maybe, maybe so. But either way, pretty cool. Oh god, animations aren't there, but what else? It's a pain in the ass to get... Well, no. It's... If that was fixed, I'd be fine. But what else? So we got the snub nose gun. Never ever going to use that, unfortunately. So I think your gift snub nose, Joe. Asshole, Collsworth is gonna rape you. Hi there. Do you need um? Do you need some help with anything? Maybe picking up beer bottles that I accidentally threw on the ground. Welcome, Swanky Joe's. What can I get for you? Let me see what you got. I ain't drinking your piss water. I got all kinds of booze. Take your pick, Wastelander. Welcome to Swanky Joe's. If you ain't drinking, you ain't staying. If ye ain't drinking, ye ain't stinking. Alright, what's up, Cindy Lou Who? What do you need? Nothing. Time for me to go. Later. Later. Alright, what about you guys? You guys got any sweet stories? What do you want? I don't know, some green hair? I just came for a drink. What's your problem? You're pissing me off. Talk to Jazz or Kitty. They're the friendly type. All right, Professor Angry. Jazz, you look like a pirate. Apparently, you don't want to talk to me. Hey, you. Have you seen a guy named Bill? Little Bill? Little Bill? Bill? Bill who? Well, I don't know his full name. I just know him as Bill. He wears leather armor, and he's a real scumbag. Hmm. Bill the scumbag. Nope. Bill used to be part of our gang. He got pissed off because his weapon was busted during a skirmish with some raiders. I'm sorry. Next thing you know, he's missing, along with my gun. I know he's hiding somewhere, most likely somewhere in Nipton. Hmm. All right. Well, I could find this Bill character for you and then shoot him right in the mouth. Oh, yeah? Yep. I'd sure like to have my gun back. Kill Bill. If you oh, him, ho, 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 kill God. that son of a bitch. All right, news about Bill. You have nope. Bye. See ya. What about you, Kitty McLore? Hey, you. You look like the type will do anything for some caps. Uh. What? I'll give you a hundred caps if you do me a favor. I'm not sure. Her voice acting's pretty good, actually. It's, uh, very clear. Quality's good, and I can actually goddamn hear her. Normally I wouldn't ask someone I don't know to do me a favor, but none of my friends are willing to help me. Could you skin this raccoon? They all feel it's too dangerous. My best friend Darius has gone missing, and I'd like to know if he's okay. He's probably dead. So you want me to find your friend? How is it going to be dangerous? Well, you'll see. Well, I think he may be up in the mountains somewhere. There's lots of wild animals up there. So yeah, you know. yeah, I heard it. Up in the mountains? Why would it be there? Is he a mountain lion? He goes up to the mountains with his friends sometimes to get high. Oh. They usually sneak into a ranger station tower. I'm almost positive he's up there. Well, ain't that peachy. I'll go check it out. Oh, thank you. Oh, he's probably dead. I guess you have... Nope. I need to Bye. go. Bye. Lost friend. Lost friend. Lost friend. Drink the drink. Just gonna check out these bathrooms. Make sure they're up to snuff. This is, what are you doing? Hello. Good lord, Eve. Put some clothes on. What do you need? I'll need some type. Later. I need some type for my breasts. Alright. Is she the dancer lady? No, that's her sister. Let's see what's in here. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna break into this. It's gonna be awesome. Alright, guys. Keep watch. I'm going to steal everything in here. Maybe not everything. But a good amount. Son of a bitch. 
Swanky Joe is one swanky bitch. Alright, come on. Rit, rit V300. Crusade. Oh. Growing. God damn it. Well, you know what? Uh, something right outside your window. You should probably look at that thing. It's crazy. And, alright, guess it was nothing. My bad. Disengage lock. Oh, that's all this is for? What lock? For the desk? What lock? What are you talking about here? Yes, yes. No, 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 no. Alright, cool. Where's this door? Where's this door? Oh. <laughs> Hi there. I was watching this Al Chess Breach video and they couldn't find the door. It was amazing. Also, if that weapon had really good stats, uh, I don't care. How about that? It's always, uh, it's always a blunt way to say it. I don't care. Because after I'm done with this mod, I overwrite the save file. Doodly doo. -doo. Alright, so we're gonna go into the woods and somewhere else. Kill Bill. Lost friend. Find Kitty's friends. Okay. Uh, find Kitty's friends. So we gotta find Darius, and we gotta kill Bill. Alright, well, I guess we'll find Kitty's friends. What was that? Did you see that? There was a dead body. Freaking. Oh, what was that? I wish I could rewind. There was like a dead body flying across the road. Or like along on the road. That was so creepy. Either that or it looked like it was flying. It might have just been dead. Dead just like my game. Alright, so I spawned myself. Not spawned. I traveled a little bit east just because sometimes game the game kind of doesn't like it when I spawn directly on a mod thing so how do we, how do we gotta get up there totally went the uh, wrong way it's always good it's always a plus always enjoy it when this happens so if my radiation suit on come on Fine, we'll go over Silver Peak Mine. Ding dong dong ding dong. Ding ding. Ding ding dong. <laughs> Hi right, there, you're gonna die. Real quick. Now you're dead. Now you're dead too. Alright, so I'm gonna put my armor back on so I don't need this anymore, hopefully. Pretty sure I don't. Nice. That's why the game crashed before, because I dropped radiation armor or something. Radiation armor, yeah. Yeah, that, that really makes sense. God damn it! Alright, well, uh, just thought of this. I'm going to do a three-strike rule. Um, well, you know what? I'll just see if it crashes again. A lot of people have been saying I have a lot of mods on. I have an entire seven mods on when I play normally, and most of those mods are my companion ones, and uh, that's why it's crashing, because it's taking forever to goddamn load. I don't know, sometimes get mo mods get a little iffy when it's like a whole new area inhabited by NPCs. Uh, come on, don't get iffy on me. Let's get this big sweet tower over there. Look at that tower. That tower's like, why don't you come on over and get some baked potatoes? And look at this. I'm gonna buy so many baked potatoes. We're gonna have a baked potato party. Sweet. Good springs. So oh, we're looking for Kitty's friends. Oh, Mr. Gutsy. How are you? Robbie. Sorry. It is restricted for wastelanders to go up the tower. I'm going to kill you. I was going to check out the view. Who are you? I am Robbie. And like I said, the tower is restricted. But do not leave. You may be helpful. I cannot leave my tower post. And I need something. 
Yeah, you need a robot voice. What do you need? I require a certain circuit board. Okay. This circuit board will complete the repairs I've made to the communications array. Can you help me, Wastelander? Maybe. Possibly. I'm up to the challenge. Excellent. The most likely place to look would be a scrapyard. If you return with the circuit board, you will be properly compensated. With robot hugs. Circuit board. Nope. Of course, of course. Don't let me keep you. You sound slightly more British now. Alright, I wish they had done at least something with the, with the voice. Uh... And a little modulation or an echo effect would have made that at least ten times better instead of some kid trying to speak like a robot. Alright, let's see. Uh, is this, is it right here? Oh wait, Robbie's Resistors. I like that quest name. Robbie's Resistors, they're all the way over here. Good lord. Gibson Scrapyard. Alright, well, let's look for the lost friend real quick, and we'll see where Kill Bill is. Kill Bill is all the way down here. Good lord. Alright, so we'll do lost friend, find the friend, find Robbie's poop. Go in the old caves. More caves! Just when you thought the caves were over, get ready for caves. The mud. Even though there's not that much cavage. There is an island as well, and I can't talk anymore. Is anyone down here No Kitty? I'm supposed to find her, her friend or something? Oh, Jesus. God damn, I hate Cazadors. Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. Yeah. Oh, son of a bitch. I know what I'm going to be doing this week. Download the Jerry McGoolberry mod. So, uh, oh, a little baby. Um, does anyone here know Kitty? Anyone? You? Oh, we got little baby Cazadors over there. I'm completely murdered. I love this gun so much. It's like a Gatling laser, but it actually does something. It's amazing. And it's green. Oh god, worst sound ever. Yep, we get it. We got poisoned by Cazadors. We get the gist. Is that one here? Got a Revenant's power armor helmet. Amazing. That's pretty cool. I'm not going to take it though because I've seen that already. I've worn it. Ooh, thousand caps. Ooh. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Get down there. Alright. What? Well, don't I look like a mother's uncle? Not even supposed to be down here. Oh, someone did mention that the grenade launcher. Let's let's look at this real quick. If I remember correctly, that was it. I think it might be it. Yeah, this shoots other... shoots plasma grenades. Holy shit! That's fucking awesome. Timmy grenades. Or timed. Helium. And plasma. This is awesome. Plasma grenades? Oh, that's so cool. So, um... Yeah, if my game crashes, I'll look at your name and I'll mention it, because that was really... That was actually pretty awesome. So thank you for mentioning that, Mr. Man, Mr. Lady, whoever you are. 
out there. Batman. I'm Batman. Alright, so where's this, where's this bitch's friend? happened. Oh, is he up there? Can I not go up there, though? Aren't I not allowed? Well, I'm gonna go up here. Please don't shoot me. And apparently your warning for me to not go up here was completely worthless. So, uh, slowly going up this ladder of death. Good lord. We're broadcasting some quality television to the people of the Mojave. It's gonna be the tiniest place. Hey there. Hey Vincent. Got a nice mustache going on. You do not have a mustache, I apologize. So, uh, this is where you work? Wow, this is um, probably the most cramped job I've ever seen, especially with my death on here. Probably not going to help you out. So, um, I'm looking for someone. Looking for someone. Definitely looking for someone. Well, hello there, Wastelander. We don't see many visitors up here in these hills. What brings you so far away from what's left of civilization? <sighs> Cuddlesworth. <laughs> what are you looking at? I saw the ranger station while I was up exploring, and I thought I'd check it out. Also, I'm looking for some kid. Horror, are ya? Period like space. Caves? Cause I have a big problem with some cave dwellers. Maybe. You refer to it as a big problem? What's the deal? Question mark. We have a ranger safe house below the main ranger station. Below that is a cave. In that cave is a giant night kim that keeps terrorizing the camp. In that cave, there's another cave. Okay, so you want me to get rid of them? Exactly. Just bring me back his stealth boy as proof that you killed him. Oh, Ooh. and one more thing. The cave is swarming with rad scorpions. I'd be careful. Opie do. Alright. Sounds dangerous. Sounds like fun. The sooner the better. Here's some stim packs. I'm sure you'll need them. You can get to the cave. Fantastic, Nightkin. Alright. Later. Alright, later. So, I don't know where the damn kid is. Is he, like, up here? Where the hell is this kid? Maybe he is in the cave? No, because I went in the cave and it was like, nope. What in here, asshole? So, pretty cool. Um. Wood. Treehouse thing. Pretty cool. A little bit too clean for my tastes. Unless, like, I guess you could say that Robbie cleans this wooden panel every day for the rest of his life. So that's why it's so clean and glossy and beautiful. But, uh, I don't know where this kid's supposed to be. I guess I'll just start looking in these. I just stepped in a bear trap. That's great. If you guys see a kid, bottle cap mine. Thank you. Great. Nothing. Except for some blueprints. This is, um, the park ranger. He lives in here. Hey there, Bob's wife. I'm looking for a man. <gasps> Bob, your beard! It's amazing! So do you have any lost kids? Vaults? Piano? Something you're missing? You come a long way for nothing. There ain't nothing out here in these woods except wild beasts and bushes. Those are my two favorite things. Two favorite things. You don't have anything you need help with? <laughs> this has never happened. Well, there is one thing. Never mind. As I was getting water from the well, my amulet slipped off my neck. It fell in. And I'm too old to climb down and get it. Old enough to die. I could get it for you. Well, that would be very kind. But one thing you should know before you go, a giant mole rat lives down there. All right. You better be careful. You still want to go? Uh, you know what? I'm definitely gonna go. Get it yourself. Okay, I'll get it for you. I got nothing better to do. Plus, I like killing vermin. Lovely. Here's the key to the well. You'll 
need it to get inside. Thank you. Bye. Bye. And Professor Beard, do you have anything to say? Well, hello there, Wastelander. What are you doing here so far up here? Looking for bushes and beasts. My name? Well, people used to call me Bob. So, I guess it's Ranger Bob. I, uh... God damn I lost it. my hat. It's my favorite hat. A Cazador flew away with it. I found your hat like two seconds ago. So I'm guessing you want to get it, right? Well, you could if you want. Yep. Sure, old man. Is there a warning for me or is it a waste of time? I ain't helping the old man. Oh, yes. So he's going to be generous. Great. Where did my hat go? The most amazing quest name ever. All right. Ranger Station Bravo Outpost Logs. Great. Visitor Logs. Great. Good thing this computer's here. Away. So we got all these sweet quests. Maybe they turned. Maybe they turned that girl's friend into a robot or something. How may I serve you, master? Yeah, may I serve you, bastard. Are we supposed to be? We're supposed to be finding. Is it an object? Find Kitty's friend. Is it a stuffed animal? Her friend? There's nothing here, Kitty. Is it the Brahmin skull? No. The hell does this bitch want? Oh god, I'm gonna kick that woman so far in the. <sighs> kill the Nikin. Go and kill the Nikin. <laughs> Old Lady Blues. Uh. Let's go kill that Nikin. What's up, frame rate? Nothing. That's cool. This place looks safe. Not from me. Hey, asshole. Look at me. Just die. No one's gonna think any worse if you die. It's gonna be just fine. I don't want time. What's this Dick Meyer doing? I'm gonna just stand there. Come on, fight me. Oh, Dick Meyer. Okay, now you fight me. Yeah, you should you should go out there, you guys. You should uh, you should probably uh, you should uh, you should you should go out there. I'm just saying, Cuddlesworth, you should probably go out there. Or we could just stay in the tunnel entrance and shoot him. There we go, beautiful. <laughs> Steve, you are amazing. Uh. I get a stealth boy. Oh my god, you have killed the Nikon and recovered a stealth boy. Now that you have the Nikon stealth boy, return to Vincent and tell him how great a story he missed. Heavy incinerator, no thank you. Let's see if there's anything back here. Probably not. Nope. Alright. Uh, let's get his hat. Let's find this, uh, this nice old lady's damn thing. Oh, okay. Finding stuff. Ugh. This is a long quest mod. It's pretty good stuff. I mean, besides uh, the voice stuff, it's not that bad. That's pretty good. Hmm. 
Voice is just the main thing. You either gotta, I don't know, if you do a quest mod, you either gotta go full out with the voices, make them really good, or just don't have them at all, because, you know, we've all been there. We've all played the Borat mod, let me tell you. If we haven't played the Borat mod, then, uh, we fell in those damn, damn girl, are you crazy? And the game crashed, wonderful. Okay, just restarted the game, and there's enemies here now. Don't know what's going on. Oh, it's just little mantis. Little mantis babies. And now they're dead. Hey, Robbie, why don't you do something? Why don't you do your damn job? Well, I guess these mantis eye aren't really posing any threat. But hey, if it's living and it's in front of me, I gotta shoot it. That's, that's one of my main obligations. So, let's try this again. Oh, hi there! Jesus Christ! <laughs> well, that was different. Mr. Cuddlesworth, if you could move. I just want to pick this amulet up. Better get this back to Bob's wife, or sell it on the black market. Oh, come on. Oh, rat meat. No, thank you. So, that was... Very quick, good lord. I was expecting more, but whatever. Hey, uh, hey, Robbie. Robbie, there's an enemy behind you. Not sure if you're, uh, if you're following this on your telescrum. And yeah, it's dead. Alright. So, we got the. What did we get back? We didn't get the hat back. We need the hat. What the hell did we go down there for? Not for that guy. We went up for that guy. Alright. Actually, I'm gonna cut. I'm just gonna cut and go find this damn hat. Screw that. I'll be right back. Alright, sweet deal. Um, also, Gonk Raider. That's who suggested uh, that the gun has different things. So, thank you very much, Gonk Raider. Much appreciated. Hope you get that gonk out of your shoes. What do you need? I need a big potato and I need it stat. Lost Ranger hat! Oh, you found it. Thank you. You are the savior of the wasteland. Hells yeah. Oh, I almost forgot. Here's payment for your troubles. Oh, I appreciate it. Here's yep. Don't bother putting your hat on. I still know you're a bald man. Still sweeping up the uh, feces that you didn't get to the bathroom with? No, don't worry, ma'am. What do you need? I need you to look at me right in the eyes. I found your lost amulet. Looks like you made it back safe and sound. Hope it wasn't too much trouble. Here's something for your time. Thank you, Wastelander. No problem. You should probably get. You should probably look into that giant mole rat thing. It's. Wouldn't want that to happen again. It's pretty, pretty horrible. So, uh, oh look at this little. Oh look, he's he's getting warm by the fire. There you go. Get get some more warmth. There you go. It's very warm. Yeah. All right. So I'm gonna go all the way up there. God damn it. That's. Gonna go all the way up there. Get, uh, you can just stand there. And I'm um, gonna give this guy his uh, flapjacks that he requested. And um, then we'll go find Robbie's stuff. And uh, I guess Kitty's shit out of luck, because uh, I can't find anything that she's talking about. Whoa, 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 whoa. What Vincent. do you need? Nightkin. You have the stealth boy. The Nightkin must be dead. Great work. We can all Thank you, Nightkin. Thank you. Time for me to go. Later. Later. I sound like a rapist. Later. My god. The big horners are planning an attack. I'd warn them, but I have more pressing matters to attend to. 